Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm in the middle of making um, this pile of journals that I have here for Christmas because uh, I really want to get them out to you. Um, and I'm also going to be up here filming quite a few videos today, hopefully, but I'm really late. It's already to, over, after two in the afternoon, just one of those days. Um, I was really unsure whether to make this video and then I've decided that I'm going to. So the whole purpose of this channel is if you look back at the first early videos, it, they are for absolute beginners. They are for people like myself six months ago that didn't have a clue about journals, that didn't even understand the jargon of, you know, distress ink or anything like that. And in those videos, I kind of try to explain, you know, how I had pitfalls with cutters and what cutter I've now bought, which is this Fiskars, and try and help you if you're just starting out from the very beginning. Now obviously as I get more experienced, my channel will evolve. But to start with, there's a huge amount of things, as you know, that I need to learn. I'm learning how to create digitals. I'm trying to also continue with my website building course, with my Pinterest course, with my Instagram course. I've got a lot, I have a lot happening. And I do that while struggling with a chronic illness. I'm not trying to do this for sympathy or anything like that but obviously when you first start out the way to learn would be to reach out to more experienced YouTube creators and I just wanted to hop on and say that if and when I do get quite a lot of uh, you know say thousands if I ever get to the point if I'm ever lucky enough to get to thousands of subscribers it doesn't matter who you are or how you are starting out or whatever I will always always help other people and I will always share my email address and I will always show your digitals or your creations on my channel without a doubt um, I've had a few people do that for me just out of complete and utter generosity you know who they are I've mentioned before crafting cousins by Mimi with love they, they, so many people um, Tina at Shabby Dabby Doodah did it for me as well but where I find it really sad is when you have a lot of support from creators, but at the same time, when you do contact others and say, you know, what do you think of this digital? Um, I, I hope you don't mind me asking, but I'm just starting out, or I wondered if you could possibly um, accept this digital on my behalf and just tell me, you know, if you can tell me if you would use it on your channel. Not asking them to, but asking them if it would be something as a crafter that they would use, if they would promote something of that caliber okay or whether it needs more work so i'm not asking them to share things on their channel i don't i don't ask that that's for, for each creator to decide and i'd rather them do it because they've enjoyed something they watch of mine um but i do think it's sad when you might email someone and weeks go by and you get no reply or you've asked something and you know they've received the message on etsy but you get no reply <laughs> and I have to say it saddens me because most of us with a few exceptions and there are some fantastic exceptions are women and we need to support each other in our endeavors because there's too much against us from the time we're born and I don't want to get into a feminist rant but it's true um, so it's really sad also that the people that I'm the two people I'm kind of have in my mind that have done this are both British <laughs> My American cousins, <laughs> you guys over the pond have been amazing. You are the people that have supported me more than anything. You know, you're, you're just lovely. And some British people are absolutely lovely as well. But I'm really disappointed this morning that it's now got to two months on roughly. It's come up on my phone, um, two months since contacting this person, that person. And I've had no reply. And it's literally just for that extra little bit of insight um, because they're so experienced and they've been doing YouTube and they're crafting for a long, long time, much longer than me. So I just wanted to hop on and say that I'm feeling a bit disheartened today, but I want to say that in the future, if ever you have a question for me, if ever you want to email me, if when I have a big enough audience, you want to send me your digitals for advice, you want to show me what you've crafted, you want me to share your Etsy shop on my channel, I will always do that for you. And I'd like to take the opportunity as well to thank every single subscriber that I have. 
I've told you all before, I've been through a really tough time over the last few years with health and having to give up my career. And having to, being able to start something new and learn again and kind of get involved with something completely different and having kind words in my comments has been, you have no idea, honestly, what it's meant to me. So I just want to thank every single one of you for subscribing, for watching, for commenting. You're amazing. You're lovely people. You don't realise how much that helps someone. I'm not looking financially to make a fortune. That's not why I'm doing this. And this is why I say when I put these journals in, these are not going to be expensive. They're going to have flaws. They're going to be a beginner's journal. They are going to have bits that aren't correct in it. But I'm doing it because this is my these this is my new hobby, and I want you to have something that you can afford that's enjoyable and that you can get some use out of. I'm not in it to get thousands and thousands of subbies so I start to get paid by YouTube. I'm not in it so that my Etsy shop takes off because shortly I'm going to be closing it down. I'm going to leave it for a little while but I'm going to be over in the new year in the next few months building a website and that's where I'll have all my digitals and everything else for the future. But um, for now it's going to stay. But I'm not looking to be this entrepreneur simply because physically I can't dedicate hours and hours to running a business I just can't do it so for me this is a hobby and I hope you benefit from learning from my errors and let's face it there's a lot of them <laughs> and also just having fun crafting from the beginning and learning from the beginning and kind of progressing with me so I, I just wanted to say, and I, you know, anyone that's a that's a, um, a subby watch, sorry, a, a creator watching this, um, you know, please always, always, if someone contacts you, just you know, help them out because we should all be helping each other, especially in such a rough time. You know, we all need to support each other. Anyway, I don't mean to whinge or do a negative video because I'm enjoying my crafting up here I'm slicing away and getting all the ephemera ready so I can put together these lovely journals for you and um, go through my beads as well I'm hoping to add some beads and some lovely things to it as well excuse me I'm gonna cough <coughs> excuse me um, so yeah that's that's my my message for today care about each other you know support each other and of course craft yourself happy uh, until later on today, guys, um, take care. Bye.